Yo, it's William slash Jamin here, back with another, um, second update on my, um, three gecko tanks, and, um, I just got home from school, and it's very tiring, so yeah, I, I, I want to do this video, and, and, and before I get to these geckos, please, please smash the thumbs up button. And can we please hit 15 likes on this video and I'll do a third reptile update and um and please and please also so please also subscribe to my channel and please push the notification button if if you want to be notified if you want to be notified when when I post a video and please support me and please do anything to try to help me or what I'm trying to say is just please just because I, I, I seriously need 15 likes just that's it just 15 likes can we reach 15 likes so I can so I can um do a third reptile room update and so let's get to it so what we have over here is um it's um is um Oakley and Oakley she is about she's about like a year old and she no Wait, she's about like two or three feet old and um it's so right now um in this in this right up here guys right here um when crested geckos usually should stay around um 70s and, and near 80s to because and and if, if 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 you have a female like like this one is like this one is, then you should, and if you if you have a male and a female, you should make you and if you have like two eggs, it it's the max you it's the max eggs you want, you only want two, you you have to move the the female into a different cage, and you have to cool her down, and and when she's when she's cooled down she won't she will, she will stop laying eggs eggs and um. Now, um, and you, I uh, can't see it, guys, but, um, I'll point the camera down. Okay, can you see those little holes right there? Those, every single, each hole, right there, there, and there, and there, are little holes that she females, that, that she female digs, but, but she, but she male don't dig at all. And, um... And what you need to do, if a female is is ready to actually lay her eggs, is is what you need to do is get like a little um, get like a little um, coconut or like, I'm gonna show you in this other gecko in this other gecko's tank. Okay, that you just you just need that that one right there, that right there. It's like a little, it's like female geckos, and 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 they can go in there and lay their eggs. And so yeah, and um, and this one is a adult. This is a this is a um, and this is Lucky right here. And this is Oakley right here, and um, and they want to be up like very very high, not very low like 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 this low, but they want to be like very high. Cause see look. Cause um, I'm just showing you an example, okay? And, and you have to have like something a little bit sharp, like like a fake alligator skull right here, cause they will they will scrape their um back and their whole entire body on this to to actually get the extra skin off of them. And right here it's um water, and over here is rapashi, and you have to get like one or two um bushes, like bushy places right here. Then, then here's like this vine right here. There's, there's like, right here is like two vines. 
and in, in, in this little tank right here that, that I'm showing you at right here on this tank I want to hold um five babies and um and if you, if you want to hold five babies in here you can if you want to hold um adult male in here you you'll be able to and um and do not and all the signs like 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 male and females they will you know personally fight and see, see who's the dominant female or the, or the dominant male it's like a male line and, and a female line and the male and, and the most dominant male will actually will actually, will actually get to eat first drink first and have and have and have half of its other territory and um and so yeah and there and these echoes are very territorial if you put two like if you put a male and a female together they're they're very territorial and 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 just like Brady and O oh, and Camo are just perfectly fine because they've been together for like about like hmm let me think um about like four years now and they fight it once in a while they're just like actually they and their tail can drop off and never grow back I think I said that in the last in the last video and so yeah and um they're very fascinating animals they are they are beginner animals and they can live up to 15 to, to 10 years it, it, if really good if, if they are taken good care of and they can and they can live in hot and desert place like 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 like, like subtropical means like it can live in in, in like the rainforest and they actually came from new new Caledonian and they are very fascinating creatures and so yeah and these and these geckos were cost range around like eighty to seventy nine dollars at a pet smart and a at pet co and 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 that and let me tell you that is, that's 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 a lot cheaper than the Alligator Alley. Alligator Alley, freshly just like a little newborn geckos like that big, cost eighty dollars. Freshly just a little one, and this one just already had. This one already was already hatched an egg long, long time ago. So, an, an adult female, three hundred like two hundred dollars. Um, adult male, four hundred dollars. I don't know why. I, I I don't know why people put the prices on on harmless little geckos and just try to make them as like trading because because they're not because they're actually animals and and um and these animals will actually fall which make their tail fall and they will bite you because this one have and camel also bit camel also bit me twice so. It it doesn't matter uh, of the temperament or not, cause they're cause they're kind of temperamental, and um, so yeah, and and you have to have um a lamp, you have, you have to have like a little, you have one like this, you and this is like a starter tank, and with a little that and that. Then you also have to have um, this right here, a little missing bottle right here. You have to have this to miss them. And it says pump six, six to ten times for spray. Warning: Do not over pump non endotinin for toxic chemicals. So yeah, just fill this with just clean water and um, just just like that over there clean water right there and um and, and just get them in that in the little bowl right there costs like probably like $25 the tank costs 80 the dirt will cost like $9 at PetSmart the other head will cost like 3 the bushes will cost like um, 
six a piece and the in the back of the wall is just there and um the vines is like saying like two dollars and you can get all this and you have to get this and this is this is like nine dollars because because this actually goes inside of here and back to here and it goes down and it's it's right here I don't I don't want my hand bitten off so so here is right here if you guys can see it that well yeah it's right there oh no yep it's right here see that look okay guys look and just just like your finger just just mirror up on there There you go. And so yeah guys, um I think that'll be I think that that's that'll be it for today for for the second reptile update room update and I hope you like this guys and stay tuned for our she um for our she the reptile video three and if if we can hit 15 likes on this video and and hope you guys have a ha, had like a great day at school i did but it was pretty sucky ish but i i really did have a wonderful day and and just just take care of your animals be inspired about animals have fun with animals and and have and have a nice day, guys. Peace.